So every Greek restaurant serves feta cheese, but this place, the Shish Kebab Hut in Peterborough, Ontario, does something incredible. The hot pepper feta dip. And people love it. The Shish Kebab Hut has fantastic food. The Shish Kebab Hut is like home cooking. So what are you eating today? I'm having a Shish Kebab, because I'm at the Shish Kebab Hut. Or right, some lamb kebab, and a nice feta salad. It's all good. Oh, oh, ah! Ordering the Saganaki, it is the flaming cheese and it's fantastic. It's great. So what are you eating? Hot pepper feta spread. It's absolutely wonderful. It's probably the Shish Bob Hut's signature. Hot peppers and feta is a combination of peppers and feta, and we bring them together. Yes. And these are the peppers that we use. Yeah. Uh, this is a yellow hot pepper. Yeah. And this is a red sweet pepper. We put them in the deep fryer and we cook them. We'll put this one over top. This way, they're, they're fully submerged into the oil. Should just take a few minutes yep. and uh, turn black all on the outside, and we'll be able to peel them. Great. This, the smell brings back uh, a lot of childhood memories, for right. sure. Well, there's a lot of similarities in the cooking, too. Very Gre close together. Grease in Italy. We can peel the peppers now. Are you up for that? Yeah, sure. As you can see, peel is right off. <laughs> this is hot. Can I just watch you do this? This is all the feta that you this, use. This is a combination of cow and goat's milk feta. And it's a harder feta, and it absorbs the oil a lot better than the softer feta. Does. Nice and salty, too. I like that. I like a nice uh, salty feta. So we put a few peppers in. This comes over here to us. Great. We're going to add some oil, mix up the hot peppers and feta. The feta pepper dip is fantastic. I love it. It's delicious. It's got a good little spice to it. We will grill some pita, and I think it's time that you taste this. Oh, man, that's great. Don, that's so delicious. That feta is just incredible. There's a little bit of heat to it, but not, not crazy, like not you said. Bad. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Wow, that's so good. Well, welcome to the shish kebab hut. Mm. Why are you always excited to be here? Because the food is great, and I like the ambiance. Are you a regular here? I'm here once a week. The Shish Kebab Hut is the place to go for fresh Greek food. Pick up one moussaka. We're making moussaka. And that's the proper way to pronounce it, right? Well, you know, there's two different ways that, that people say moussaka and moussaka. Moussaka is a layered dish with eggplant, potato, ground beef, and a bechamel topping. Layered dish mm -hmm. with bechamel. Mm -hmm. Sounds a lot like lasagna and sounds like you stole it. That, well, you know, we just took it and made it a little bit better. Wow. You know, it's one of those things. This is a, a classic Greek dish, right? It really is. So you're just getting some color on the, yeah. on the, the... Just cooking them enough so they get a little soft. That's kind of what we're looking for right there. Oh, God. That one, uh, we lost one. Okay. So we just lightly fry up these potatoes. And now we're making uh, the meat layer, which is the top layer. So we got delicious ground beef. So all these herbs are coming over? All these herbs. So basil, rosemary, thyme, and we have some chives. And this is nutmeg. And you can smell the, the fresh herbs. Eh? We put in the tomato sauce. We stir this up. Now, at this point, we're ready to layer. Eggplants? Eggplants on, is the first layer. Yeah. We grab the potatoes. We just layer, layer, put this on. You spread that out evenly. Make it smell really good. Yes, it does. Next, a layer of feta cheese. Is there a dish that doesn't have feta cheese? I egg? hope not. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're adding flour and butter to warm milk and eggs. The bachamel. Ah, teamwork. Greece and Italy. Greece and Italy Number together. one all the huh? way. Huh? You got it. This bakes for about 45 minutes. Oh, yeah. You want a fork? Oh, you know what? Thank you, but oh. I carry my own. Oh, nice. Thank okay. you very much. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that is fantastic. The eggplant is so tender. It just, like, melts in your mouth. You got this fantastic bechamel on top. Oh. I'm very happy right now. And you know, it's not just the food. It's a great place to have some fun and talk to people. I can get the Greek experience without having to travel. This is called tiganya. Tiganya. Yeah. It's basically a spicy Greek stir fry. Many colors of peppers uh -huh. going into it. Spanish onions, mushroom. We have zuzukaki sausage. This is a Greek sausage. It is. Chicken breast. We marinate it with salt, pepper, oregano, oil, a little bit of lemon juice. This is like a Spanish paprika. So I'll mix it in a little bit, cook for five minutes. The sauce is thickened, and it's ready to be plated. And you serve it over rice? You serve it over yep. rice, squeeze a lemon over it, cracked pepper. Beautiful. And here you are, tigan yeah. Tigan yeah. That looks fantastic. Oh, that's really nice. Chicken and veggies and rice. That's just Greek comfort food all in a bowl. You call it tigan yeah? 
I call it taking, oh yeah. I'm John Catucci, and you gotta eat here.